ladies and gentlemen, welcome audience, television viewers. It's the Les Tomac Show. And boy, have we got a show for you tonight. This band that's going to be performing here for us tonight, they had one hit after another, and then they kind of faded out for a while. But they've made an incredible comeback with Sad Girl Crying in the Rain. And that is none other than... Fling, Jammer Son, and the Stunt Brothers. I broke your heart. You went to Arby's. And when we broke up, you fled to Mickey D's. Now we're apart. I see you at Dairy Queen. And just last night, at Dairy Queen. <laughs> Oh, she's a sad, hungry girl, crying in the rain. Oh, she's a sad, hungry girl, crying in the rain. You broke down and you cried at the Chinese buffet. Then I saw you down at Taco Bell just yesterday. I miss the good meals. What can I say? But it takes a lot more than some good food to make me stay. Sad, sad girl, crying in the rain. Yes, she's a sad, hungry girl, crying in the rain. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Mm -hmm. I'm your heart. You went to Arby's, and when we broke up, you fled to the keys. Now we're apart, I see you at Dairy Queen, and just last night, at Dairy Queen. <laughs> Rita, thank you, Rita and the residents. All of you, I know, absolutely enjoy that performance of Finn Two Timer. Well, Rita, have a seat here and tell our studio audience and the viewers at home a little about your group, a, little, a history of the band, and a little bit about that song. When I started out with the hesitations, the other girls were afraid to go on stage, hence the name of our group. Cute boys hitting on us got us out of that. Our first hit song was based on one of my exes you know, Les, that song we just now performed that then two-timer? 
Well that was the hit that made it all the way up to number 2 on the charts. Anyway, about this ex of mine. Well it turned out that he was going around banging the lead singer of virtually every girl group out. The Tell Me Nots, the Love It Alls, the Main Squeeze. Let me tell you, he did all of them. And he expected me to stick by him and put up with it. Sorry, I had no aspirations to be another Tammy Wynette. And yes, to tell the truth, I had a few flings of my own. I even once got laid by a boy band? Well I suppose the word laid is a little melodramatic. It was a threesome or menage a trois, I was the crim filling in the center. A certain cookie comes to mind. And oh it was very, very sweet. And absolutely decadent. Recorded live. Now, ladies and gentlemen, here together again with lead singer Wiggle Wrongly on this special tribute to the slain blacks and the artists, we have Emaciated Butterfly performing their hit single, Baby, Why Do I Cry? <clears throat> Baby, oh baby, oh baby, why do I cry? Baby, baby, oh baby, why do I cry? Why, 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 why? Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me why. Why? Tell me, tell me, tell me why. Baby, oh baby, oh baby, why do I cry? Say hey, 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 baby, oh baby, why do I cry? Baby, oh baby, baby, why do I cry? Baby, oh baby, baby, why do I cry? Slaying death of Blatz and the art and the artists from Murgatroyd. We're having a, a tribute show uh, to Blatz, and in which we're going to have people who knew and were personally acquainted with Blatz and uh, come on the show and talk about the artist Blatz and, of course, reminisce about Blatz. But first of all, we've got the man emaciated butterfly back. Man emaciated butterfly back. And although. The band member Floyd, who left them many years ago, refused to appear. And, of course, Blatson, who was a member 
of the emaciated butterfly uh, can no longer, obviously, uh, appear with the emaciated butterfly. The remaining members of the emaciated butterfly band of the emaciated butterfly band are here to to sing one from the vaults, a tribute song that was done after JFK was slain, and it was called "Oh No, Jackie O." But in keeping with the somber, mournful tenor of the times, with the tragic slaying of Latson, I now present to you, to you ladies and gentlemen, the emaciated butterfly with "Oh No, Jackie O." Oh no no, Jackie oh oh no 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 oh no no it landed in now at an airport love field. It was sunny in November and the air had a slight chill. She wore a pink dress and red roses in her arms. The motor came to for downtown, how us say we're headed for home. Oh, no, 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 Jackie, oh, oh, no, no, Jackie, oh, oh, no, Jackie, oh, oh, no, 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 Jackie, oh, oh, oh. And at Ely Plaza, three rifle shots rang out. The last one was a headshot. Jackie scrambled to get out. Secret service pushed her back into the car at that point, point. And they sped onward to Parkland. It wasn't very far. Do, 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 no. Jackie, oh. Oh, no, no. Jackie, oh, no. Jackie, oh. Oh, no, 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 no. Mr. Gertrick, Mr. Gertrick, uh, we have had a very, very successful week, uh, very, very good. Uh, we manufactured lots of uh, Vincini face cream, and we uh, sold a lot of Vincini face cream. So uh, this evening, I would uh, like to invite you to uh, take uh, your young lady in the company, uh, me and uh, Judith. Judith is my uh, friend in Zotto. And uh, she and I are going to the movies tonight, and I would like to uh, have uh, you accompany me with a your girl also. Uh, we will go in and see a movie tonight. Uh, so uh, please, uh, Gatrick, uh, come with us. Come with us. I'm buying. I will pay for all of our tickets. Come, come. <laughs>
and its deep-seated superiority complex was beginning to resurface. When the band emaciated Butterfly got a gig on a cruise ship on a big Caribbean cruise, it was Floyd's great opportunity to do his solo. He had worked in practice for two weeks. The captain and Tennille were going to play backup, and Edie Gourmet was going to sing a duet with him just before, just before he performed his solo. But then at the last minute, not feeling very well, possibly from something she'd eaten on the ship, Edie Gourmet came to him, and Edie said, Floyd, the song is off. The captain has left the ship. I don't guess we're going to be performing tonight. Floyd was crushed. His solo career was not going to take place that night because the captain and Tennille had already left the ship. So, there, adopted Hong Kong, Floyd went into a deep, deep seated depression. It would be ages before he was to shake himself from this depression. In the meantime, the other man members, he made sure he did. Butterfly, attempted to cheer him up by releasing a song that was dedicated to him. But Lloyd laughed out at all of them, and he took the song as a meaning insult instead of the compliment for which it was intended. He thought it was an aspersion cast against him, referring to all the media rumors that he had a man crush on one of the other band members. But the song, Floydy, Floydy, Floyd, Still became a top 40 number one hit. Floydy, 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 Floyd. Floyd, my boy. You will always be my boy. Floyd, 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 Floyd. Till the sun turns into soy. Floyd, my boy. Till the moon turns to bok joy. And Floyd, 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 Floyd. Floydy, 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 Floyd. And Floyd, my boy. You will always be my boy. Floyd, 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 Floyd. Though it sometimes seems to annoy you. I know it will not destroy you. Floyd, 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 Floyd. Floydy, 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 Floyd. Floyd, my boy, you forever be my boy. Floyd, 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 Floyd. Till the sun turns into soy. Floyd, my boy, till the moon turns to bark. Joy, 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 Floyd, 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 Floyd. my show. And tonight, to start the show off with a big bang, we have the somewhat local legend and local celebrity, Uncle Frank, who's been calling in to call in radio talk shows all over town for years now, and he's even appeared on my show a couple of times before, as you may recall. But Uncle Frank has a new hit country song that's climbing the charts. It's called... My stepson, where's a stepson? So, everybody, welcome Uncle Frank. Yes, uh, Uncle Frank here. 
Les Tomac invited me on to the show to sing my newest hit song. It's climbing the country charts. I reckon some of y'all have probably heard this song lately. It's been getting a lot of airplay. It's called My Stepson. Where's the Stepson? And it goes a little something like this. Detroit's Live Theater, the incredible spectacular production written, created and produced by Aunt Suki, the new country and western satire, the phantom of the... I want to be a free singer and sing for everyone. A sing country song looks like it would be a lot of fun. Hey, they call that man the Phantom of the Opry. He can take a girl and teach her how to sing. He might wear a hat and a mask and swing around on a rope. But he don't drink, he don't smoke, and he sure don't do no dope. Yeah, they call that man the Phantom of the Opry, and he can teach a girl how to sing. He can teach a girl how to carry a tune. He can teach a girl how to sing. And they call him the Phantom of the Upray. He can make all the bells ring. They call him the Phantom of the Upray. He can make all the bells ring. I'm not skateboarding, I'm on my shred sled. I gotta stay mobile, 
on wheels. Four wheels. human females that you like to cut to pieces. Flashy two. 
coming for you. Spicy two. Coming for you. Spicy two. Put your money on the table. Flash it too in this corner. Put my bed on flash it too. Put my bed on flash it too. How about you? How about you? Put my money on flash it too. Now CRZY brings you the new jazz novelty hit video Nosferatu. Talk Recorded live. Peanuts Rada, gonna drink some blood tonight. Peanuts Rada, peanuts Rada, not for two. Tis, 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 tis. Hey, not for gonna drink of some of blood tonight. Hey, not for to go, not for to, not for to.
by Roxana Pearson and the Evanescence. Anything you can need, anytime, anytime, anywhere. Anything that you want, any place, anywhere, you want to Anything you need, any place, anytime. Oh, yeah, anything you need. Vincini luggage. Vincini has a suitcase for every occasion. And don't forget to grab the latest Vincini cosmetics, cologne and fashions. Vincini offers the latest, most stylish fashion for today's girl, because she's fast and she's smart. You know why? Because she's a Vincini girl, that's why. Get some Vincini products today at a store in your home. Dip, 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 
Welcome to Murgatroyd City in an alternate reality, a parallel universe very similar to our own universe, but where persons have very different lives and different personalities. Skateboarder Timothy Lawrence Sun has stumbled into this alternate universe through the energy time flux field, and he is fascinated and startled by the many episode differences. This sort of Papa Frank is brought to you by Paransky Fashions, the swap. Dignified look for the on-the-go upwardly mobile professional male. Woody the Woodpile Boy is the international fashion model seen wearing these awesome threads. Men, grab your wallet and your credit cards and let's go get dressed up for a successful career today with Paransky Fashion. Television viewers, it's the Left Tomac Show. 
And boy, have we got a show for you tonight. This band that's going to be performing here for us tonight, they had one hit after another, and then they kind of faded out for a while. But they've made an incredible comeback with Sad Girl Crying in the Rain, and that is none other than Fling, Jammer Fun, and the Stud Puppies. I broke your heart. You went to Arby's. And when we broke up, you fled to Mickey D's. Now we're apart. I see you at Dairy Queen. And just last night at Dairy Queen. <laughs> Oh, she's a sad, hungry girl, crying in the rain. Oh, she's a sad, hungry girl, crying in the rain. She broke down and you cried at the Chinese buffet. Then I saw you down at Taco Bell just yesterday. I miss the good meals. Oh, I cannot say, but it takes a lot more than some good food to make me stay. Sad, sad girl, crying in the rain. Yes, she's a sad, hungry girl, crying in the rain. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Mm-hmm. Oh, I broke your heart. You went to Arby's. And when we broke up, you fled to the keys. Now we're apart. I see you at Dairy Queen. And just last night, at Dairy Queen. <laughs> Now CRZY brings you the new jazz novelty hit video Nosferatu. Oh, the collection, Recorded but you'll also live. get the new jazz novelty hit Nosferatu. That's right. Yeah, that's right. Nosferatu. 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 Not
finally caught up with Wiggle Wrong, the emaciated butterfly, for this exclusive interview in which he talks about Blatz and the artist who was a band member of Emaciated Butterfly. And he reminisces about good times with the band and how much he misses Blatz and the artist who was slain in Europe by their Murgatroyd serial killer. So, I'm going to go straight to the interview with Wiggle Wrongly. Well, it, it, it's like Floyd left, left the band, you know, Floyd left the band and all because he, it's like he just, Everyone thought he had the man crush on Blatson, but in reality, it was it was I. It was I who had the man crush on Blatson. This is at a time when I, I had these bisexual allergies, you know. It's before I had fixated myself on females more and all and, and so forth. And I could never, you know, become as completely, openly, and blatantly gay as Blatson. I, my bisexual side won out. But yes, 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 I definitely had a man crush on Blatson. And he did influence several several of my songs, several things that I wrote. They were they were directly influenced by Blatson. I think part of the reason that Blatson left the band is because he was being accused of being phony and artificial and superficial. Everyone said that he was just a copycat. That everything that Blatson did was derivative, and even even within the art world, if you look at his art, he's been accused of never doing anything original. I mean, even this latest. Exhibit that got him killed, the the one based on the Murgatroyd serial killer. Well, none of that's original. He just took pictures and photographs of the Murgatroyd serial killer, that, you know, by surveillance cameras, the crime scenes, and he just put his little artistic flair on them. But there's nothing original there. It's just all derivative. It's all copycat. And yet, that's the way Blatson always has operated. That's how he's always been. It's just as if he has no innate talent of his own. It's just, let's go copy someone else. That's That's all he does. But yet, of course, he, he had claimed, you know, to be an artist, and definitely he was an interesting human being. Definitely, I value my my relationship with Blatson, both as as a band member and outside the band. So, so again, uh, thank you, Led Gallo, for having me uh, here on your show. Well, you're quite quite welcome, and, and I appreciate you coming on here. And we will definitely be having you here again. Uh, a more exclusive interview concerning the tragic demise of Blatson the Office.